Hello Zany friends, I am Lainey. I am Marshall. And today we're going to talk about a book that we received for review called You Are Obsolete. It is a graphic novel and Marshall did read it since graphic novels are not my thing. This book is a horror suspense graphic novel. The storyline, and I'm, I can just tell you what happens in the very first issue, this reporter who is disgraced for saying something that people didn't like, it doesn't really get into it. She gets contacted by this remote island to go and do a story there. And she's like, well, why would I want to? You want to do a story. She gets there and every single adult that she sees has this really creepy face. They're all smiling so big and they're very scared of the children who apparently have developed some form of cell phone app that allows them to kill anybody that is older than 40. And there's also some mind control aspects into this. And you can already tell from the way things are in the very first issue, there is no way this reporter is going to survive this experience. The rest of the graphic novel is ex just showing you how she doesn't survive it. What I did like. I'm going to tell you something that I really liked in this. There is an artist I've never heard of before. He is a Russian artist, and we're going to have his name right there. This dude is good. Yes, sure, there's stuff that's creepy that y you... Uh -uh. But there's also some just really good illustration going on here. All of his pencil work just... It's surreal when it needs to be surreal, and it's tense when it needs to be tense. He is good, and I want to see more of his stuff. It creeps me out every time I look at it. Yes. I'm gonna be glad when you're done with this one. All right. I wish that my first introduction to him had been with a story that I could have connected to more and that I could have felt more intrigued by. If you are looking for good art and are looking for just kind of a, a horror that you don't have to think a huge amount about, you can give this a shot. I did end up giving it two stars, if I remember correctly. So thank you so much for watching, and until next time, stay zany. Bye-bye.